Hey, look where we are, soup and fresh. What is soup and fresh, you might ask? Most of you might remember what soup plantation was or hometown buffet. Do you remember when the buffets were way popular before 2020? It's back, baby. I'm in the city of Rancho Cucamonga off of Vineyard and Foothill Boulevard. I think the only thing that's changed is the name. It used to be called Soup Plantation. Now it's Soup and Fresh. We are on our way in with our family today. Let's go take a look. Let's go see how fresh this is. Here we go, going on in. And then just to let you know, lunch is $16.99. And that's from 10.30 to 4. Dinner is $18.99. Oh, if you're a senior, you get a little bit of a discount. So you're gonna grab a tray, create your own salad, add a beverage, pay the cashier, enjoy your meal. Look at that. Everything's all white, brand new, shiny. Look at this, right up our alley. All right, I'm gonna get some uh, iceberg lettuce. That's my favorite. There we go. They have different salads, uh, lettuces to choose from. There's spinach, kale salad, a little bit of onion. Just a little bit. Put them on the side because they might be a little bit too strong. So. Shaved carrots, cucumbers, peas. I'm gonna grab a couple pieces of uh, broccoli because I'm hoping that they have a broccoli salad down here that's my favorite. Fresh cucumber, shredded zucchini, corn, cabbages. Ooh, like me some mushrooms. Got salads to choose from. Here's my favorite. And look, they even have a. They have two bins of it because they know people are gonna eat. They're gonna eat them. This is one of my favorite things. I wish I could make this at home. I just don't know if I would be the only one that would eat it. There we go. Nice garbanzo beans, red bell peppers. Put a scrambled egg on top. There we go. Now they give you containers so that you can put your dressing on the side or if you need olive oil or balsamic, red wine vinegar. There's the ranch. Oops. Making a mess. Honey mustard, kidney beans, a little bit of olives, and bread, blue cheese, jalapenos, regular cheese, and just a little bit of that. There you go. Pickles, and then your toppings, and your salad. So my salad's made. Your silverware, knives, forks, spoons. All right, for one, it was twenty eighty-five. Get in line for the bread section. Oh, this is hot and fresh. So see, you can get a blueberry muffin, a corn muffin, a blueberry muffin, which I know from past experience that that's awesome. Got myself a corn muffin. I'm gonna get myself some pizza. Look at that. Got plenty of pizza to choose from. Baked potatoes. I have butter, honey butter, or regular butter. I'm gonna grab a couple of those. Look at that. Get my ice. Kinda they serve Pepsi products here. But you know what I think is the best? Is this strawberry lemonade? All right, let's go look at the soups. With the soups, you come up here and you grab your own bowl. You 
get in line. Oh, they even have pastas too. Macaroni and cheese, Alfredo, marinara penne. This is minestrone, house chili. I'm just going to put this on your uh, baked potato too. I'm going to go after the chicken noodle. Not much left in that one, so we're going to hold off on that. Waiting for refill. Mushroom soup, clam chowder. Oh, corn chowder. That'll probably be good. A little spoonful of that. If you need condiments on top, they have onions, cheese, sour cream, bacon bits, chili, tortilla. So in the dessert bar, normally they have cones right here where you can make your own uh, ice cream cone or you can make a bowl of ice cream and put your chocolate on top. They also have a uh, granola, tapioca, fresh fruit. Those bananas look like they've been in the refrigerator. If they would bring them up to a warmer temperature, that brownness will go away because we did have a banana and the banana was really good. So even though it's brown on the outside, got plenty of fruit. There you go. If you need coffee after your meal, they got coffee there. They even have a freshly brewed iced tea. Look at that. There you go. If you were to come to this location, they have plenty of seating outside because that line was long. It took us about 20 minutes to get inside. There's maybe about 30 people in front of us in line. My lunch was amazing. It was fresh, it was good. I couldn't have asked for better company. You know, I have, I'm here with my friend Jennifer and her family. It was good. I had to recommend you taking the truck out here to Rancho Cucamonga. I don't know if more locations are be gonna become available. I know we have old Sioux plantations that closed, you know, obviously four years ago now because of, you know, the world shut down but if there's one coming to you soon highly recommend it or make the trek out here to rancho cucamonga all right that's it until i circle back around we'll see you soon bye